mices. Hi friends, I'm Leo and I'm back again. Today we ain't gonna talk about bikes, photo, drones, and uh, well, whatever we could talk about. Gaming, yes, gaming. I mean, now it's lockdown time again. Thank you COVID for that. And when you're doing lockdown, what can you do with your, all your time? You can do a vlog. You, you, you can do a vlog. Uh, this is not a vlog. This is just a, a video of, well, this is going to be a review about two mices that I have here. But before we do that, I would just say I'm not sponsored. I'm not. I'm just speaking straight out to my heart, straight to you. So this is just a suggestion of two awesome gaming mouses. The thing is, those are wireless. I know. Some people hate wireless mouses because they're not re reliable, they say. Oh, you lose connection. Uh, they are not fast enough. Well, that's the old school, man. The new school is. They are super good, especially those from the Steel series. The Steel series have two awesome wireless mouses, and they've been around for years making them. I know they're not the only one out there. Some of them are maybe better. I don't know. I haven't tried them, so I don't know. But speaking of mouses, the thing is, it's very personal. A mouse is so personal that it could be like your shoes. The mouse must fit so well in every direction and you know how you're holding it. Are you the claw hand? Are you the fingertip man? Or okay, when you just find your right model, you don't want to change it. You keep it forever. You keep it and maybe you buy 10 of them so you can have them for, I don't know, two years. I was in that school too with the Microsoft mouse back in the days. It was super nice mouse to play CS with. It was not CSGO back then, it was like CS 1.6, I think. Headshot. Headshot. And that mouse was awesome and then stopped making them. So there I was with no mouse anymore and I tried to fix it up, but you know, at the end of the day, I need to throw it. You know, it was used. To find a new one was a struggle because you know, you have your old, you know, old thoughts about how great the mouse should be. So yeah, I was out there struggling finding the correct mouse. And I know this is a delicate problem to change a mouse, but once you take the step out there and change a mouse, you will see there is so many good options out there. R like now, for example, these super light mouses that are coming. Who wanted a light mouse? No one, because you thought you're gonna slip and throw it to the wall. But that's not what's going to happen. But it also depends on what you're gonna do with your mouse. Are you super gaming in the CSGO, you need a fast mouse? Or are you doing, I mean, slower games, like regular games? The mouses we're gonna talk about today, as I already told you, is from the Steel series, and it's those kind of nice friends we have here. This is the Revolve 650 against the Aerox 3, both are wireless. And this is also with Bluetooth. Wireless and Bluetooth. What about that combination? Nice. Well, I think we start with the Revolve 650. It's this one. It's wireless. Yeah, I know it's a wire on it, but you can you can take it away. So I just had it to show you guys that you can use the wire when you're gaming. So it's no problem that the battery runs out, but the battery will not run out for you. The battery lasts for 24 hours. And if you recharge it for 50 minutes, you get 10 hours of gaming. Isn't that awesome? I think it's super awesome. I have a nice design. It's anti-slippery surface, not too much rubber. It's perfect in that way because if you have too much rubber, it gets gross. You know, you have your fingers here and you have chips and you know, some crisps and you smooth and smudge it around this, will not be good. This one you can just wipe off, but it's still in your hand, boom. In my palm, my palm grip, this one is called, is good. I reach all the buttons perfectly. Even those on the side. You have three buttons on the side, by the way. Not only two, you have three. So that's pretty cool. But it's kind of heavy. Let's do the warm up. Oh my god, this feels so much bigger and heavier. It's not sliding well. Kind of, yeah, it's sliding well. 
I mean, compared to the today mouses, this 650 have been around for a couple of years now. And it works good for gaming and it works also kind of okay for Counter-Strike but too heavy because once I jumped to the lighter mouse this became like a tank. It is, it is kind of a tank because you can also put in extra weights into it. Here. They come like in, in 4, 4 grams weights you put here. That means 16 grams extra on this heavy mouse. So why do you want it heavy? I mean, yeah, heavy is steady. That's what it means, heavy is steady. So if you want to have a, like a steady mouse, for example, when you edit in Photoshop or when, when you're doing smooth stuff in games, like you wanna be like very precise. Like, oh, like sniper precise. It's a good mouse. As I said, I play CSGO with it, but it's not like a super great mouse for CSGO. It's not, there are better, better options out there. But for, a, um, a, I mean, a mouse they want to use for everything. This is awesome, and also for the money. 60 euros for this awesomeness? I mean, that's a no-brainer. Go buy it, still serious. Revolve 650, nice one. If you want to have a mouse that you can do basically everything with. Next one is the Aerox Free. Also wireless, of course. The USB-C, huh. This was not, the other one didn't have USB-C, it's have a USB mini. But this is USB-C. Well, it's, I mean, what? USB-C have been around for like since 2017. Something like that is standard today. I don't know why that one is out of standard, but they've been around for a couple of years, so maybe that's an excuse. The cable it comes with is super soft, you know, fabric one. So it's the same business with this one, but the battery lasts 200 hours if you're going for the Bluetooth. And, I mean, let's say the half with the Wi-Fi. That's kind of awesome compared to this tank, which is much heavier and bigger. And this one is only 68 grams. Did you hear that? 68 grams, I think. I need to look it up again. Wait. Yeah, it says, says 68 grams. That's nothing. That's super awesome. It's so light and, you know, and it's, it's kind of small. But it doesn't matter. It, I get used to it. I don't have baby hands, but I've been been gaming with this one for like a week now and I mean it's perfect but there are downsides to the small mouth mouth what is that mouse this is, this is a mouth this is my mouth yeah all right so this is this is the mouse and the downside with this mouse is that it's it is small that's the downside with it, which also is an upside, but the downside with a, with a small mouse is that it also gets small buttons, like this little tiny here. This is only for changing the DPI, so it's not that you used to use this a lot. But the side buttons, come on guys, come on still serious, listen now. If you put buttons here to a normal grown man, like my, I am, and as you see my, my hands is not like super big. They are like normal hands. This button is unnormal. They are really small for little girl fingers, maybe. They can put them a little bit longer up here. So I hit, so I can find them when I try to crouch in CSGO. Do you know how hard it was to, 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 to I mean, before I got used to it? It was like, a, where is the button? I can't crouch. So, with that said, that's the downside. But the upside is that is con concave here goes in a lot. So you can place your thumb here without no problem. You don't drag it to, to the table at all. It fits perfect there. So I'm I'm pretty impressed by by this little little friend here. How good it is. It's a good, it's a, it's a small and so light and yeah it's beautiful mouse it's well close to in love with it and it's not expensive either it's 100 euros for this one it's a little bit more expensive than this one but for what you get you get bluetooth you get wi-fi well, no wi-fi but wireless kind of wi-fi wireless really good for csgo i like this one this is this is a fast super fast mouse and i know you hate wireless don't hate wireless Try it, it's really good. It will work just fine for you. You know, it's 2022, everything is wireless. It's, it's nothing that goes to wire anymore because wire, wireless is the future, it's the thing. So yeah, and if you wanna go with, with the wire, yeah, plug this one in and be like back, back to the 800. 
I mean, Steel Series really did it this time. The downside was these buttons here. You need to work this up. It's too small. It's too small. Next episode will be about not gaming. It will be about something else. I don't know yet. Let's see. But it will be posted in three days. So I post two videos a week. So subscribe and you will see them and you will find out. This will be fun. See you. Arrivederci. All that jazz. I'm Leon. I'm out.